Welcome back to more Avengers. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe. So I do want to address one thing. Um, some people are saying that, um, you know, I got an exotic, but it didn't actually show up on the right hand side up here. Um, sometimes the uh, the reward screen is bugged. I mean, look at the uh, the rewards at the bottom there. It says legendary, legendary or better quality. So you're pretty much guaranteed at least a legendary reward or possibly getting a chance of getting an exotic or running last avenger standing um i've had it even in the mega hive where it'll only show one of the two items on the right hand side um usually it shows the uh the character specific piece there not the hive mind piece um before when you know when we used to farm mega hive maybe a couple months ago both uh exotic showed up there so yeah i don't know I, I'm, I'm not doing anything different or anything out of the ordinary i am just literally um playing last avenger standing and then checking my my bags to make sure that something didn't appear there that didn't show up on the side that's all But yeah, just to uh, show you my inventory, um, I put everything in the bag, so you know everything that we get on this run will show up in our bags. Hopefully, I will try and break down the blues um, midway, or at least around ten, floor ten. We'll break down blues if I remember. Anyway, yeah, we're gonna continue with this thing. I mean, it takes an hour, which is unfortunate. It it really takes a long time to farm this. And you're not guaranteed an exotic at this the end of it. This will be a rewarding but grueling mission. All our efforts against AIM have led us to this point. Our best chance for success will be to have Avengers ready to step in should a teammate become incapacitated. For time to getting exotics or TTE, time to exotic. <laughs> Uploading uh, the Tachyon Rift is probably your, your best bet. You can pretty much run a Tachyon Rift in 15 minutes. And you have a chance of getting an exotic in that. So, I mean, you have a better chance of getting an exotic out of a Tachyon Rift than you do in this. Or in, in the, wow, well, Mega Hive is guaranteed, but in this for sure. I've marked the Hive's entry terminal on your HUD. But we're only running this because one YouTuber said it was, you know, very high drop rate and you should farm it right now before he gets nerfed. Access that terminal. So we're doing that, right? I've got one in about five seconds. Anyway, this one is actually after today's daily reset, so we're supposed to have a higher chance. Oh, wait, was that an X? We're supposed to have a higher chance of getting uh, an exotic. The first time you run it after a daily reset, that's what they said. I wish Kate wore like combat boots Be instead of pixie anything. things. But anyway, whatever. They just don't suit her outfit, her boots. Or a pair of Dot Martins or something. Head for the location on your hut. Numbers are small. This will be a cakewalk. Or a pair of caterpillars. Go 
Don't hit me, don't hit me. These enemies must be defeated. Why are they teleporting over there? See that guy cracking me there? Ooh. Not sure how I'm gaining aggro when Hulk's got the uh, the abilities to tone and stuff, you know. Yeah, when I play, um, you know, when I play games like Valhalla or uh, even Cyberpunk now, I um, do stop the video recording and then pick up where I, you know, and continue somewhere else. In this though, I just record this in one sitting. So, I mean, take it the way you want. If you think I'm cheating and trying to promote, you know, getting exotics some way, then so be it. But. I'm telling, I'll be the first one to tell you, you know, I've got one in about five so far, and that was the sword. That's the first exotic I've seen drop for Kate. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Attack there and uh, it isn't doing anything. Well done. That squad member has been neutralized. Another enemy defeated. Nice thing is now you can actually attack while uh, enemies are doing well. Your teammates are doing a takedown. It's kind of cool. It's, it's basically iframes. You know, they can't. It. I'm just gonna take all that full damage. The team are no longer a threat. on your heart.
These enemies must be defeated. I was one hit away from getting killed and hope Let's see if this one bugs out. Let's see if an enemy falls through the door or not. The enemies have been defeated. Nope, not this time. All right. has a server bank nearby. Server bank. There they are. Neutralize them. Doing a little better on time right now, I think. Aim will throw everything at you to keep their servers intact. Destroy them all. I'm literally just clearing the map before I go after the other server farm. Just because these enemies can go pretty... Uh, a number of them can get 
big very quickly. I didn't think of what I wanted to say there. So giants are real? Of course. My brother Loki is a giant. Though a rather small. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. Look for a chest with gear nearby. It would be cool if Kate actually had a slow, like, uh, um, uh, cryo, because then she can slow them all down. I think that's why she doesn't get cryo. I mean, imagine all these enemies working at a slow speed. Alright, let's see if this one works this time. Oh. Almost. Alright, we're gonna try this. No? Damn it. Oh well. I'm sure that's a bug. I mean, it bugs out for Kamala even now, every now and again as well. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. I also wish there was a rapid fire, like I could hold down the button for the arrows, especially the uh, scatter shot. But the minute you hold down the button, it charges up. And the PlayStation controller has no turbo button. Do not know, but there will be enemies to hit. Aim scientists are fighting aim forces. These damn scientists. They want to defend. I say the exact same every time. If they want to defect, then bloody defect. Scientists doing to me. Nothing. Other than she's getting caught all the time. Like, did my drone even do any damage? 
I do have it so that when uh, when I am near my decoy, I do take less damage. Or any of them might do. Oh, that guy looks like he's falling through the floor. Where oh, is that the guy? There has to be one that always bugs out, isn't there? It's there. Oh, you got it. Does this count as rescuing allies? Alright, I didn't know that. Yeah, I do really like Kate's traversal though. She is a character that I could enjoy if the game wasn't so damn repetitive for farming for gear. Like how many times have, have well, how many Game times have I done that to understand Especially farming for gear with my Hulk. And then you have the Mega Hive, and then you have Tachyon Rifts. Like how many times have we farmed this stuff just because we want generate. exotic items, you know? Disable them. Really? Destroy the turbines. Destroy the turbines. Yeah, I get it. This aim has turbines. sent forces More to turbines. stop you. That turbine is finished. Well done. That was sick. That guy came out of nowhere. You disabled the turbine. I got come out of my gym is no longer She never heals me. Maybe I should switch her out for someone more useful. I 
Anyway, let's grab this blue because we're gonna get it anyway. We're on 7 or 14. We'll do a couple more. And then we'll break down. Uh, some stuff. Live in New York. I can see why you chose it for your five year hiatus. I met some of your friends. Oh, you did? Mm. They told me tales. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. That was interesting. I just started doing a whole bunch of crits out of nowhere. They weren't big crits, but there's a lot of them. Hey, does it feel weird? What? The stretchy arms? Not really. Kind of used to it now. So your organs don't get all like. Head for the location on your heart. These enemies must be defeated. Nice. Okay, both at least pop down. Oh, it's when I need it. My decoy doesn't do that anything. Like, they all attack me anyway. Here comes another wave. Terminator, that's what you did. Holy crap, boss, get the crap out of me. The other is charging at me. Who is hammer on it? Yeah, I mean, if, if Kamala's not gonna heal me, I may as well switch over the cap. His rally cry is really good. We'll do this one and then we'll break down blues. So, uh, you know any good jokes? <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. If you can gain control of AIM's network, yeah, that was a pretty good joke, I, like that. I can infiltrate their security system. Head for the terminal so I can get you inside the lab. AIM's network is equipped with a multi-point authentication system. I need access to multiple terminals. The more the better. AIM will attempt to initiate a shutdown protocol if they gain access to the terminal. You cannot let them. I'm inside aim security system. Beginning infiltration. Shut down protocol is 
initiated their shutdown protocol. Yeah, we got a bunch of blues. We'll break them down when we get on the other side of this elevator. Let's get them broken down. We'll keep all the uh, non-blues and we'll skin through them at the end. If you want to pause when I go over one of the non-blues, you're more than welcome to. But I will go over them at the end. Remember I did move all my other gear into Head my to the bank location on your heart so that we could see all the gear that robbed. How are we doing on time? Thirty three minutes. These enemies must be defeated. Right now. Oh, I didn't Pretty nice, I like that. I like this map. This map's one of my favorites. Because all the enemies are so close together. You just kind of get in the middle and they kind of go back and forth. The turrets are a bit annoying, but... I mean, me being the most accurate range in this group, I should probably take care of them. <laughs> But yeah, we're actually doing really good on time in this one. Might be done in 45 minutes. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. I'm stuck. A shield ally is in trouble nearby and needs your help. I 
Alright, we are in the next area. Let's get this done. Every member of the elite team must be defeated. Location on your heart. Why is it? Yeah, the these enemies like must be defeated. All the time now. Do my uh, thing in my uh, go down because stuck. It's easy. Tell me how that makes sense. The enemies have been defeated. Last floor. Bring it on, Monica. And before we do this, I am gonna actually change my inventory. We have reached the hive's final floor. Just because sometimes the uh, the exotics don't actually show up. On the right hand side, when you get them, uh, it's completion of this mission.
But that's beyond my control. Alright, we got two items in each slot. No artifacts. An elite aim team is close by and on alert. Updating your HUD. Oh my god. Really, just target the damn computer. See what we get. You have to listen out to the sounds. I don't think we got an exotic. Well, maybe. That was kind of a clashing noise. Hmm. Let's see, though. See, nothing shows up in terms of loot. Well they always get something here, uh, some kind of artifact. I would high five you were it not a digital construct and programmed to avoid overly gratuitous displays of emotion. And we got. This is the item that we got right here. Jarvis Barrier. When taking damage, activate the Jarvis Barrier. That's actually pretty good. You don't have to dodge for it or anything. But yeah, that was the, the piece that we got. So even though the rewards for this said legendary or better, all we got was a legendary. Let's go through the gear. See, I'm wondering about this. 110% increased critical attack damage. Do I need to... Is that with the melee item or is that just in general? Because that would be 15% increased quantum energy just overall, right? I'm wondering if that might be better. Because I should get critical attack damage when... when I'm overcharged, which is pretty much all the time. We'll try it out. Not today, but we'll try it out. Ooh, and we have gamma scattershot arrows with a damage buff. That is actually a really nice one. If I had precision on it, oh my god. Because the proficient buff gives us a damage buff, and the expert buff gives us a damage buff. We have two ways of getting a damage buff there. I like that a lot. I might actually do one more. Uh, one more. Of these um, 
Last Avenger standing just to see what we get or how well this looks. Uh, I can't really swap out my chest. I do like that that blink. Although this might be a really good well, would lose so much defense rating though. How much health do we have? Eleven thousand, we're low on the health. I like that Jarvis Barrier piece though. Don't think I'd ever use that. Intensity and Valor. I'd never use that. Hmm, so we don't need this anymore, so we can actually get other stats there. Intensity, Resilience, and Valor. Of course, I get the exact same thing. Willpower Burst? Nah, we don't really do takedowns. Not very good. Let's see what this non stone is. Additional rewards from Strongbox. Precision and Proficiency. So I did buy this from the vendor, triple precision, and it's got stun damage from signature attacks and increased heroic assault charge rate, which is really nice. Um, yeah, that's our uh, singularity. That one. I'll keep a hold of that. But yeah, you know what? I'm gonna run another one. But yeah, for now, thank you for watching. If you like what you see, please like and subscribe. As you can see, I'm one out of six so far in terms of getting exotics. I've got a couple of Jarvis barrier pieces, but one out of six so far. Anyway, till next time, take it easy.